Welcome back everybody. So I wanted to make a quick little short video. Um, somebody had commented on my shorts, one of my shorts that I made about the monofilament backing on my uh, spin reel. And so I just want to clarify it up a little bit. So I made a video about how I put monofilament on my spin reels to save money. So I'm not spooling my whole bait caster with 20 pound test, which is running me $30 for like a hundred and something foot spool or spending you know thirty dollars on spooling up one spin reel when i can throw a monofilament on there 10 pound test monofilament that i'm getting 1500 yards for like three dollars and i'm putting you know filling half this spool up with monofilament and then using a third of a new spool of braided line to go on there so essentially i can get three of these spooled up with one of the small uh, braided line packages, which is a little over a hundred and something yards. So, you know, you're gonna save a lot of money that way. Now, where I lost somebody at was, they thought I went monofilament straight to braid and then straight to a hook, which that's not the case. I did kind of leave that out. That is my fault. This one's not complete yet. This one is monofilament backing, which is spooled halfway on this reel, tied with a uni knot going to the braided line. From the braided line, I spool it the rest of the way, which then I connect with an Alberta knot. Let's see if you guys can see the knot. Right there is my knot in the middle. That is an Alberta knot connecting to eight pound fluorocarbon from my braid. So I'm not going straight braid to a hook. I am throwing on some fluorocarbon for the invisibility because of the, yeah, you gotta have it. You throw a straight lime green braid down there. You ain't catching nothing. They ain't biting that crap. So I just wanted to clarify that up. I thought maybe I had confused the person that had left a comment and I just wanted to make sure that they kind of understood what, what, where I was going with it at. So yeah, and also uh, today hit 200 subscribers. So just want to say thanks to you guys, you know, because of you guys, I'm over 200 subscribers now and that means a lot, you know, it keeps, keeps me going, keeps my drive for making these videos. Um, I enjoy making these, it's, it's a lot of fun. It's a lot of work, believe it or not. There's just a lot more work than I thought it ever was, you know, for watching YouTube videos. Um, you know, I use my phone a lot, but I also use my GoPros a lot to make them, which then I gotta take footage from different videos and piece them all together, but you know, it's worth it. At the end of the day, it's worth it. As long as I'm helping you guys out or giving you some information that may help you or you're getting some type of entertainment from it, then that, that's awesome. So. Thank you guys so much for subscribing. Make sure you hit that like button and leave me a comment, you know. Uh, I, I, I answer back to every comment that's left. And, you know, make sure you share share the channel. Share the channel with your friends, stuff like that. I think if I hit 250, I think I'm just going to do a giveaway. You guys deserve it. You know, taking time to watch my videos, subscribing to my videos, liking them. So, we'll see. See if we can't hit 250 and see what I can come up with, but until then guys, tight lines.